Oh, by the way, I got a new camera. Oh, wait, that might work. Hold up. Ah! <gasps> I can't. Oh, that's good. Okay. Let's, let's go ahead and give it a try then. Me opening it. So, oh, God. How the fuck do people do this? Oh my gosh. Okay. Okay, you know what? This isn't working. <laughs> Why is this so complicated? That works. That works. Okay. Oh, can you open it? Sure. <laughs> God damn it. Open. Jesus, okay. Oh, okay, that was good, that was good. Okay. God damn, fucking elbow grease and, ooh. That smells hella good. Okay. <laughs> the camera's too heavy. Wow. Mm, all right, that works. I drop a bunch of them on the floor, I guess. Oh, that's horrible. Horrible. Absolutely horrible. <laughs> like that. Mm, oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm. That's perfect. I love it. Okay. Okay. Okay, they're done. They're so cute. The Bell Nails in Lincoln, my favorite place. We're at Yankee Dumpling today because they opened a new location in Roseville. I've been to the Davis one and it's really good, so we're gonna check it out and see how it is. We 
just had Yankee dumpling. What do you guys think? I, I loved think it. It, really, it was really good and I'm surprised that this quality of authentic Chinese food exists in Roseville. And I'm really happy that there's good food in our close proximity. Oh, I, I loved it. It's good food. <laughs> good food taste. I yeah. love the shumai because they didn't sting on the amount of meat and shrimp. It was very, very like meaty and juicy. Good food taste. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Me, me go back tomorrow. Okay. Yum, so yum. overall, it was good, and we would go back. So I'm trying to. Oh, wait. So I'm trying to change this cabin filter, and I got one right. And when I try and put it in, it doesn't fit. So anyway. Um, so yeah, we're trying to figure this out right now because the, the filter I got doesn't fit, but by just barely. So I sent my mans to go cut off the end, hopefully, <laughs> hope it doesn't. Anyway, so don't, don't come to me for car advice because I can't even change the cabin filter, which supposedly is one of the easiest things you can do. Anyway, <laughs> I have to document yeah. it. Did you cut it? Yeah. No, it still doesn't fit. Weird. It's like, um, I don't. Weird. <sighs> oh my god. Wait. <laughs> In the wrong way. Wait. Why was it? Oh my god. Oh, I was putting it. Oh, shit. No, because it goes in like this, right? Hold on. <laughs> oh. Oh. <gasps> it worked. Okay. Hey guys. <laughs> uh, oh, door. We did it. Oh, by the way, I got a new camera. So I got the ZB1, ZBE1, which is basically the the camera I had before this. But I had the E10. But the 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 the, the E1 is has like a lot better specs. Um, and it also shot. It's a full frame camera and it shoots in the 4k 60 without crop which is what i really wanted because the current camera i have now which is the sony a7 IV, it's nice and all and it's great for like professional you know photography and video but the limitations it has when it comes to vlogging and how heavy it is like i wasn't about to walk on the street with a fucking 30 pound camera on my arm anyway so that's why i made the investment and i got this baby because it's just a lot smaller and it's more convenient so whenever i just want to like point and shoot like pick up the camera and you know like just be on the go it's a lot easier it's a lot lighter and it's full frame without the clap so which that's nice so yeah